But hey, it's Rob out in the tent today. Uh, it's very muggy, uh, but it has cooled down a little bit. It's uh, almost evening at this point, but uh, I wanted to come out and try and get something done. I got a package the other day, and I thought I would show you what it is. This is a metal cutting bandsaw. I have wanted one of these for quite a while, and I have a bunch of uh, metal tubing that I'm going to be needing to cut. And while I do have a regular vertical bandsaw, it's not really designed for cutting metal, at least not very well. This one's got a lot more power, and it's got the weight to be cutting metal in a way that I don't have to uh, be putting it through by hand. So this is pretty much what comes in the box. Uh, these are all the pieces that we need to put together. I got the instructions down here. So I'm going to have the dog walk over it and uh, start putting it together.
One adjustment that I wanted to let you know about is this one, which is the socket head cap screw with the cap in it. What this is, is this allows the motor to swing freely. So you can change the belts, or change the belt speed, change the, uh, I'll change the spindle speed, I guess. Blade uh, speed. And once you change that, loosen this nut, tighten this down as best you can. <clears throat> and what this will do is help keep tension on that belt so that it doesn't flop around. And this will make it a whole lot easier to do cutting. Right, so here we go. Beautiful. Stays all the way through. Okay, I think we're good to go now. There are a couple bits left over and it's actually pretty obvious where they're supposed to go. These are feet. <laughs> around here. Uh, I'm pretty sure they go on the inside. Uh, and there's, an, there's enough bolts included to put them on. Also capable of cutting vertically.